A proposed tax increase to build a new elementary school in Catoosa is on the ballot again. News on 6's Alyssa Miller is live this morning to explain why. Alyssa? Good morning. Catoosa Public Schools is asking voters to pass a $9 million bond issue to finish a project that they started nearly a year ago. Catoosa voters passed a $52 million bond last February that began work on a new elementary school for the district. Superintendent Robert Shornick says during the design process, they realized they had gone over budget and scaled back. But he says the recent rise in interest rates has forced them to return to voters with a proposed 5.52% tax tax increase over the next 10 years. As soon as individuals see a tax increase bond, they're hesitant. Uh, they don't want to raise their taxes. But uh, what I try to communicate to them is that in order for us to transform and to even think about reimagining how Catoosa Public Schools is, is, is managed, is led, is moving towards the future, if you will, we have to think about raising our millage rate. We have to think about raising our taxes. If the bond does not pass, the new school will be built without a wing for pre-K and kindergartners. They will stay in the current 86-year-old Helen Paul Elementary. And that uh, vote is going to be on February 14th. Live in Catoosa, Alyssa Miller, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6. Thank you, Alyssa.